a whole new camera system built into iPhone 4. So what we've done is we've gone from a 3 megapixel to a 5 megapixel sensor, but we're using something that has been shipping for a while in larger cameras, but is fairly new to smartphones, and that is what's called a backside illuminated sensor. It's a way of getting a lot more photons to the sensor by getting some of the wiring and stuff out of the way. In addition to that, when most people increase their megapixels, they make those pixels smaller. When you make pixels smaller, they capture less photons. What we've done is as we've gone from 3 to 5 megapixels, we've kept the pixels the same size, 1.75 microns. And so they don't capture less photons per pixel, and we have more pixels. We've got a 5x digital zoom built into the camera app. Of course, what we pioneered, tap to focus. And we've got an LED flash built in. And the pictures that we're taking off this are pretty remarkable. Of course, you can do portrait and landscape. You can see the digital zoom right there. And these are pictures that are taken right off the iPhone 4. They haven't been touched in any way. And it shows you, it shows you what kind of quality we're able to get. So we're really happy with the, the, the uh, photos we're taking with the iPhone 4. We think we got a great camera built in. But that's not all. Because the camera also records HD video. And that's HD video at full 720p at 30 frames per second. So it's real HD video. Now, we pioneered tap to focus for still photos. We now have tap to focus video. And we have built-in video editing for trimming your clips right on the phone and one-click sharing to share your photos. And the LED flash also will stay on to illuminate scenes for video recording.